Let's pretend that you're maintaining an application that has had several complaints about its sluggish performance, but you've been unable to pinpoint where the time is being spent using your existing backend focus tools. Likely, this means that your performance problems have been hiding away in the black box of the portion of your application that runs on the user's browsers. Traditional methods of troubleshooting front-end issues means that you're stuck trying to blindly reproduce the issue locally, placing risky, low-value log probes into production, or outright guessing at the issue based on your intimate knowledge of the code. In this video, I'll show you how New Relic Browser can help you to quickly unveil and understand performance issues in your front-end applications in a matter of minutes without any need for custom instrumentation or retroactive reproduction. Immediately from New Relic Browser's Overview tab, you can see two charts which will offer you the ability to perform a high-level triage of your performance problem. The first, the Aptex score, a number between 0 and 1 which represents what percentage of your user base is being frustrated by slow response times, giving you the ability to quickly gauge overall impact of an issue. The second, the Browser Page Load Time chart, an aggregated view into exactly where time was being spent while your customers were left twiddling their thumbs. This chart displays all of the common problem categories, including communication with backend servers, manipulating the data in preparation for presentation, all the way to page rendering itself. For this application, we can see the communication with the backend server is taking under one second. However, the page appears to be unusable for several more seconds due to DOM processing and page rendering, something that would have gone completely unnoticed with only backend monitoring. This same detailed breakdown chart and more can be viewed by what URL path the content was served from. This is powerful as it allows you to monitor your pages individually, so critical actions like login or checkout can't be lost in aggregation. Additionally, it allows you to understand whether this performance problem is isolated to a few select pages or if, as we see here, it is common across your entire application. Information which can drastically reduce the surface area of your investigations. At this point, you know what type of issue you're facing and what it is affecting, but the data is arguably too high level to necessarily help you understand why this is happening. New Relic Browser offers even deeper granularity into performance data in the form of full samplings of individual customer interactions. This detailed waterfall chart shows you an isolated customer's single interaction with your application from a code perspective. In this case, it looks like a significant portion of the page's slowdown can be attributed to a series of set timeout calls on the browser's window object, which appear to have been written poorly and are blocking execution. From here, you should have all the context you need to jump into the code and start whittling those seconds away and guaranteeing your users can spend less time waiting for spinners and more time enjoying your application.